Hello friends. Now in this video we will proceed with item data entry which is a little more elaborate and uh, in detail. For the item data entry we need two prerequisites. One is a warehouse and second is item text template. Remember that in our CGST and SGST account setup we have made it zero. That means we are going to define a separate tax rate for individual items. So first going into the warehouse, so go to the home page of ERP next and I don't know where item is going to be there so I can uh, warehouse is going to be there so I'll just type warehouse here and it shows warehouse tree. So let me select the warehouse tree. It shows all warehouses. Let me click on that. Okay, it shows finished goods stores available. So this finished goods store entry is already there as a, I'm using acronym as FGS. If you want, you can rename it. You can add it. Okay, please set account in warehouse goods or okay. So I just rename it to finish goods stores. If you refresh the page, you will see the new name. Yeah, finish goods stores is now available. Now let's go ahead and prepare item text template for all these seven items. Again, I don't know where the item text template will be. So I'll just type item text and show me item text template list. So please click on that. Right now the list is blank because there's no item text. So I'll create a new. My item text first is text template is product PD. And for this, I'm going to use two taxes. That's a CGST, which is at nine percent, and SGST, which is again nine percent. Please use this Excel sheet for the data. Click on Save. Ensure that your product PD item text template is now available. Similarly, use this data to define rest of the item text. 